our setup. We by now have connected the scale to the clover and we are able to interface with it. So the next thing I'd like to point out is the different units of measure that can be set up with the scale. So there's this button, unit, and it switches uh, from different units of measure. So right now it's on ounces, right now it's on grams, kilograms, and pounds. So these are the options. And it's important to match the same setup on your clover device. So for example, if you have an item set up as a gram here, but you're pulling that item up on clover, like so, let's say that item is not grams, but it's pounds, you're going to see an error that it's going to tell you that the unit mismatches. And so to fix this, we would simply switch the scale to pounds. So and you can see that it actually fixes it in real time. Um, or you can open an inventory app and change the item, right? So let's take this, um, the beef item, make it per unit and change the units from pounds to grams, for example, right? So a gram will be a G and so now when we go to register and we search for our beef, there it is, right? So it's expecting a gram, but we're set up for pounds. And the way to fix that would be to come to the scale, like so, and switch the unit to grams. And as soon as we've done that, you can see that it's working fine. And if I place something on a scale, it measures grams. Okay, and so you can see that there's different um, kinds of units of measures that can work with the scale and uh, it's important to